Good morning, welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. This is really quick. The I believe that the LBGT community, Q, whatever the fuck, should be labeled as terrorist organization at this point. And I'm not even fucking kidding. Here's the thing, people. It used to be a point when if you were a gay or lesbian, you were just happy to be accepted in the crowd, which was never a problem anyways, because you should always have been accepted because you're human and we love you, period, in the fucking story, right? Who cares about who you fuck? But now these people have gotten militant to the point where they're just the most psychotic, scary, violent human beings on the planet today aren't Russian fucking soldiers. They're LBGTQ um, activists. They are literally the scariest human beings on the planet right now. It used to, and you guys used to be so fucking fabulous and awesome. And you're talking about somebody who paints pretty shit like this. See, yeah, yeah. I'm an artist. I believe that everybody is awesome and, and beautiful, period, in the story. But you people have lost your fucking minds. And, and I'm seriously, you've gone off the fucking chain, man. You can't, you can't, you can't make people love you at gunpoint. They're just going to hate you. They're going to be like, I don't love you because you're about to shoot me in the head with the gun. No, you know what I mean? It's like, how the fuck do you get people to have compassion for your cause when you're scaring the fuck out of them and you're hating them and you're, I mean, heterosexuals aren't bad human beings just because they, guys that like pussy and, 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 and ladies that like cock, that's not a bad thing. That's just actually kind of normal. So when you get all mad at people because they're not just accepting your 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 transgender drag queen demon from hell. Seriously, when they got fucking horns and shit and they paint up their... And then they tell stories to kids. How the fuck is that any way kind of normal cool? Ch First of all, children don't need to know about sex. Period. Until they're like 16 or 14 or 15. You know what I mean? When they start going through puberty. Otherwise, leave them the fuck alone, period, in the story. And this is the problem with their education system. They're trying to transgender everybody. I love my gay and lesbian friends and, and, and fellow humans. It's who you love doesn't matter as long as it's love, right? With love. Quit being terrorists. Quit being militant. Quit, being, quit making the KKK look like a bunch of fucking Sunday socials, man. You know what I mean? You can't just burn down a fucking city because you don't like the fact that they they actually are pro-life or whatever the fuck, right? Somebody believes in Jesus. Oh, hell no. You know what I mean? We're all supposed to live together regardless of how, you know, whether you eat pussy or you cho choke on a pole, right? Who gives a fuck? As long as you're a good person and you do that shit in the privacy of your home, home and with your windows closed because nobody wants to see that shit. Not everybody's a supermodel humping. So it's usually just a bad day at Bosnia when you see two people fucking. So keep that, keep the windows closed. Quit being so damn militant. You're, if you're gay, be happy. If you're a lesbian, just be happy. You're, you're accepted. We love you. Quit making people do, quit making people, uh, you know, accept you at gunpoint. It doesn't work that way. Like I said, don't make the KKK look like a grandma's Sunday social. They're the assholes. So don't be assholes like they are, okay? Uh, it's it's important anyway uh, I love you I do God loves you he does she does they do I don't know it's a, it's a conglomerate and the universe digs you baby and wants you to stretch your stuff and be fabulous just don't scare people don't scare the stiffs they don't understand they're a little old they're set in their ways let them go they'll pass on and then you'll all be fabulous and everybody will be cool so glitter's a bad thing. No, it isn't. Glitter's awesome. That's how half of my paintings get sold, baby. So I love you. I already said that. I'm a flirt too. But anyway, love you. Bye.